All right, gamers, welcome. This game, I'm going to be trying out a gin bolt that I think should be quite good. Right now, it seems, uh, according to trends I've noticed for, through win rates, that lethality is probably quite good, which makes absolute sense since crit is obviously awful, and lethality is a stat that apparently isn't awful. So, Jin is one of the champions who certainly has been popular with lethality builds in the past. It is probably going to be quite good with lethality. We're going to try it out this game. Although, looking at the enemy comp, they have... Presumably two champions are going to get quite tanky, so we can't do full lethality, but we're going to start with at least Yomu's, which looks like a very strong first item on this patch. And then we're just going to transition that into enough crit to actually deal with their tanks. <coughs> Holy crap. It's fine. We're still in a good spot here, though. Zillin actually... May end up dying? Nice. I've still got bear if I need it. And I do need it. Make no mistake. No. Okay, nice. <laughs> that kind of fuck up there. I couldn't tell you right now what the mistake was, though. Oh, I needed to wait for the Jinx shield to fully time out before... Hitting her. I think I expected the Karma hit to take it out fully, but it didn't quite. If I'd done that, I think we might have been able to kill her without me having to flash away. I'm not going to stick around for the plating here, because Zillian died so much sooner than Jinx. I don't want him to get into lane in time to start fucking with my base and massively delaying my base. As much as picking up the plating would be nice, I can do without any of that. Alright, so now I've got Sredded Dirk and Boots compared to Jinx just having a long start. So we're off to a tremendously good start here already. Which is perfect, because this build is all about snowballing the early game. We're already setting ourselves up for doing just that. Whoa! Holy crap! Is he just dead here? Huh, I guess Jax didn't have E. He gets lucky. But Jesus. He's got no mana though, I think he is dead. He needed to back off there. Or do I have it wrong? No, I had it right. He got a little bit greedy there. Probably too tilted at his own mistake. He was like, no fucking way am I gonna get a bad base just because I accidentally dashed into the turret. But it turns out that's exactly what he needed to do. I wonder if Zillin is in this brush. Why is she so confident in a 1v2? Nope, he is not. Zillin is actually in Vi's jungle. Unless that guy is low, I don't think we should bother trying to go fight him. I have very little DPS for killing him. I should go rid it. Just barely not gonna be able to hit the fourth shot on her, sadly. We should get around to placing some vision, though. Yeah, exactly. If I could get a shield sooner, so I could avoid the... Okay, thank god. I should have let that comet kill me. Sad. Oh. Oh, okay, I managed to give it to Zillion anyway. Maybe I could have even lived if Karma managed to shield me, although that would be a stretch. It's probably for the best that I died to Zillion. Especially if it was a shutdown, which it was. 200 gold shutdown is no joke. She should be fine there. They're really not shoving us as fast as they'd like either. By the time I get here, this could be a really good engage for Karma to go for. Oh, this is a bit too early. I, I meant like... 
I wanted there to be ready, not to start going in. I wanted there to be alert of the fact that there was a plate to be made there. So she wouldn't just start, like, recalling or something, or backing off too far to engage. Okay, we're gonna go for the blind cancel? Didn't find it, sadly. It's worth a shot, though. It's hugely valuable to cancel Jinx's base there because of how low she is. She's absolutely fucked if she can't finish that recall. She'd lose out on so much more than she otherwise would. Alright, that gives me enough for Yomus, so we're just gonna skedaddle. If Jinx had any sense here, she knows I'm completely out of mana, so regardless of my lead, I'm not really a threat to her right now. So she should be looking to cancel my base. She, like, as soon as these minas are dying, instead of position there, she should be like way over here, so as soon as they're dead, or even before they've even all died, she can already start venturing out, trying to keep me in vision if possible to see which brush I go into. I just cancel my base with her traps, you know, using them for vision to then cancel with autos or throw the W into brushes, but she was just not on the ball there. She was not aware of the opportunity she had. <clears throat> She recalled. I'll crash just in case she has. We should be able to poke her under turret anyway if she is staying. Oh, she is there. I really hope we're not being ganked, actually. Oh, she missed! Karma! I mean, she wouldn't have died anyway because she had flash, apparently, but... Oh, ooh, that almost bounced and killed her. God damn. Yeah, the Yomu's so nice on Jin to just set up that free trade whenever we have the fourth shot up. Damn. Okay, we'll switch focus to Brand. Uh, no, can't. Oh, I thought that was going to be a stun. Okay, traps are actually a better way for than my Q, so that's what I'm gonna do. Just two traps, but definitely a lot better than one Q. Oh, but it still just barely doesn't kill everything. <laughs> just barely. Might as well go for the one plating. Please don't toxic no karma. Ah, uh, because this just makes it less worth for me to do that. I'm gonna have to drop a wave for this anyway. Probably would have had to drop it even if I didn't go for the plating. Okay, Udyr's gone for rushing an AP item, for what it's worth. I think I'll probably want to go straight into Lord Dominic's. I'm not sure that I want to do Collector against two tanky champions. Not on this patch. Oh, this should be very good. Got her. And I got the CS. And that little bitch there. Damn, I can't believe the Zillion lived though. Sad. Hmm. 
Hmm. We could loop around and try and get a kill, but it's not really guaranteed, so I'd rather just go for the plating. Karma's also a little bit low, so maybe we don't want to invite ourselves to be ganked by Brand. Uh, not by Brand, by Woodier. Damn, we just barely got beat the first turret. Didn't even know that was something we were competing for. Gazillion is mid for what it's worth. I think we can keep on pressuring here. She hasn't seen me, I don't think. So let's see if she's going to overextend here. Oh, yeah. Damn, so close. Without barrier, she was dead. Alright, we might get ganked. No, 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 they're still there. So she either has to base here or she's gonna die. So we want to stay at least to find out if she has based. I think she probably has. So I think we'll probably base. Oh, why is there top laner of all people here? Eh. Yeah, not good, but at least he won't be able to kill Karma too. Yeah, okay, I guess he did just get his turret. Makes somewhat sense. Although that does mean Jinx has to go top now. Oh, or those guys could defend. <laughs> nah, that's not Gragas' fault, that was just a bit unlucky. All he did wrong was lose lane, which is obviously just very normal. Yeah, that Jax is going to be tremendous now, because not only did he get my shutdown there, I assume I had a shutdown. Oh, maybe I don't. Okay, not too bad then, but he did just get, um, on top of the fact that he was already fetting kills and also had first turret, he also, I think he just got four platings. Literally four. A huge amount. Uh, he's not going to flank me, is he? I do have to be careful. Okay, so far so good. There we could also be in that brush, but hopefully not. I'm just playing it as carefully as I can. <clears throat> oh, we have a smolder. Oh, Jesus. I know Jax doesn't have flash. I already used it on me. Man. Oh my god. Wait, I'm straight up dead. I was so slowed. I guess by the Zillini? Didn't realize. Oh no, it was exactly as Jax jumped on me. That's why. Fuck. Okay, I played that ra I played that wrong. What I should have done was look to root Jax first. Although the unfortunate thing is I can't even do that. I have no way to actually proc any damage on him because my kills on cooldown and he wasn't already marked. So I guess I'm just screwed no matter what there. The moment he jumps on me. But otherwise, in theory, assuming I could mark him or he was already marked, I should use my W on him, root him, and then flash away so he can't follow it up with the uh, E. There's no point flashing away. And then he just walks back into E range because he's not rooted. And because I'm slowed by the zillion, so I can't stay out of his range. But the main mistake was that I let him get into the key range in the first place. I was playing that too aggressive. Thought being under turret would be enough safety, but clearly not. I'm not even close. Way miscalculated there. Oh man, I'm so screwed. Maybe not. Ah, there's the Jax. Oh! No! Oh, this game is so doomed, man. Yeah, I'm confused. How was he behind us? Oh, he was literally farming our bot side jungle and just ran across and killed us. Okay. <laughs> Unlucky.
Gotta say, it's not a great game for showing off a build, considering it's just been completely taken over by the enemy top laner. It's also, uh, you know, like, it, this isn't even supposed to be necessarily a hybrid crit lethality build. It's more like, depending on whether the enemies are tanky or not, you can either do full lethality or you can do critality, so you actually have some DPS to deal with tanks. But at its core, this build is just not as good for dealing with tanks as, um... A full crit build is, and this Jax is so fed that he may as well be a tank with how fed he is, uh, how tanky he is. Oh fuck. Mm, they seem to be content with giving up the Drake. So I'm gonna assume they might try and flank me there and leave. They're probably just on the Herald, though. Let's hope Smolder can deal with Jack. Smolder's actually quite strong himself. Not as strong, but... Maybe he has that ranged advantage. Oh man. Whoa. That was a desperate play. Oh look he is! I called it! Jax finds it hard to struggle. Uh, struggles with actually punishing the smaller even though he's ahead. I hope that would be the case. With any luck, smaller Q still goes through the Jaxy. I should uh, place my traps here actually. Call Lord Dominic's whenever I base, although now it doesn't feel like a great time. We need to defend here. But also, yeah, there's a wave coming in, and I don't want nobody to get that. Hopefully my team can defend this. Just please don't hard force a fight. Hopefully with Yomu I can escape anybody who comes for me here. I think they were all bolt in anyway, for now. Oh, that's so sad. Okay, we got one turret. Um, I'm not great at pushing turrets, otherwise I would be confident about this one too, but... Yeah. Jin's two greatest enemies, tanks and turrets. Oh my god. What the fuck? I can try and ult. Oh, my bad. Pretty for sure there's not a zillion. Oh, I'm over the wall. Now I need the base. I'll get to spend my gold. Oh, man. That's tragic. I think we'll probably just want to go straight into Infinity Edge. Collector is just not going to be enough DPS. I was going to say, he might be stealing our camps. I'll uh, farm this and then maybe try and deal with him. Oh, he's gone. Yeah, there was just no point using my fourth shot when I knew I could execute it very soon. Only to the audience do I show my true face. Crap. 
fucking zillion Udyr, man, is so unbalanced. Oh my god. That is so unreal. I just can't even be on the same screen as Udyr. Not even two screens away. Yeah, uh, Udyr is like the second highest win rate jungler with Zillion, which doesn't surprise me. The other one is Warwick, which I'm not so sure about. Oh, right, the Warwick called Jesus. Yeah, I've actually seen that before. And that's even though probably most of those players are uncoordinated. I don't know if these guys are duo, but at least the Zillion is smart enough to play around the Udyr. Yes, I stole it. Okay. Force the flash. I can't. This is impossible to team fight into, regardless of my build. Yeah, I may as well let small deform. He skills better. I'm going to sideline. He's also stronger than me at the moment already. So it's more valuable to have him around team fights. So instead of asking him to go top, I'm just gonna go top myself. I can't sideline, of course, but I can at least temporarily farm here. Okay, Jax is already. Top side. Definitely can't farm here for long. Really? What is my luck with these bounces, man? I think he, yeah, didn't use a Z yet. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, she started charging way too early. <laughs> doesn't matter. Oh, but the YQ, man, that was terrible. It doesn't matter. I don't think it actually mattered, though, because in high side, the Uder just demolished us with the Zillini. As usual. Yeah, can't say that Jin was a great pick here with any build, to be honest, in hindsight. I wouldn't have guessed this is how the game was going to go, though. But this is the Zillion in, com in, com in combination with the Udyr. That's just, yeah, unplayable. Don't know what would be playable against it, though. Maybe, like, at least Jinx could play Straps, I suppose. Tristana could just jump away. Uh, yeah, there's a whole lot of immobilities that are just going to suffer against that. Jin is one of them. Oh, he doesn't... He does actually block the... Smolder Q, that's really annoying. Even though Smolder Q is not an auto attack. Actually, I noticed that the other day with the fucking Ezreal Q as well. Like, why, man? It's very clearly not an auto attack. It's an ability that just applies on hit. Jaxi blocks autos, not just like all forms of one hit. Oh, fucking ghost. Okay. Makes it really hard for me to hit the generals. Hey, we're finally gonna get this turret. 
We're pretty much just counting on the smaller scaling. There is not a chance that I could ever carry this game. Regardless of how many items I build and how big my DPS gets. I'm still limited to being Jin Against tanks. I wanted to just base there. I have a lot of gold. Oh man. Karma go one shot. No. Yes, he died. I need to try and cover Smolder, I think. Uh, I'm probably in trouble now, though. No, I'm fine. God damn it, Lost Patch, I would have had Infinity Edge already. But it's the weakness of that atom that is forcing us to build Lethality in the first place. Again, I'm fine to just let Smolder form everything. How many stacks does he have? 290. Yeah, he's on a decent pace. I'm not going to be in range to auto attack anyway, so I'll just follow up with this. Oh no, Krakus. <laughs> I don't agree with my team flaming him and singling him out. When it's uh, just one of many things that went wrong this game, but... I gotta say, his performance is not impressing. Including <laughs> that one time I... Find my camera at the top and saw that <laughs> fucking disaster. Kragus is has got to be so glad nobody else saw that besides me, and I didn't make it known that I saw it. I think they might be on that? No, they're not. I'm just being dramatic. I'm not sure we can gank Jax right now though, that would be ignoring the fact that we have an open nexus. Yeah, we're just gonna go Phantom Nancer. This is gonna give me much more cutting potential than any other item. Hopefully I can do something against the Udyr. I was so sure somebody was in there. They're on it? Ah, it's over. Whoever was there must have lost Condover, I think. Oh, Smolder died too? I was thinking at least Smolder's alive. You have been slain. Oh man, yeah, he got demolished by Brand. Oh, the Brand ult was on him. Fuck. Oh, and the Jinx ult as well. Jesus. That's a little bit unlucky. Yeah, well, it was a tough game. Didn't really properly get to show off the build, honestly. Because pretty much every fight was just running away from the unkillable loot here. But uh, feel free to try it out and let me know what you think. It's got a pretty good win rate on this patch. I think it makes sense with crit items being so weak. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and subscribe if you want to see more content like this. And I'll see you guys in the next video.
defeat.